in the closing seconds of Game 4 of the NBA Finals, a giddy Draymond Green and Kevin Durant stood near the Golden State Warriors bench, high-fiving each other uncontrollably. The all-star forwards have a personal ritual of double-tapping on high-fives after one of them makes a good play. Thus the continuous slapping in this moment, which concluded in the massive hug, to celebrate their sweep of the Cleveland Cavaliers. When the final buzzer sounded, Green, an NBA champion for a third time, burst toward midcourt to confiscate the game ball from rookie Jordan Bell and then gave it to team security official Jordan said. Don't let go of this ball, Green relayed to said before going back to celebrate with his teammates. Don't let it go. Yes, Duran won finals MVP. But it was Green who took home the game ball, and perhaps rightly so. Because if it weren't for Green's financial sacrifice three years ago, Durant playing in the Bay Area likely would have been a pipe dream, and securing three championships in four years likely would have been out of reach. I took less so we could go after Katie. Green told ESPN during the finals. I am a student of this game, and I studied the business side of it and the numbers, where some people don't. They leave it up to their agent to do it. Not Green. It turns out he was the player who masterminded the Warriors dynasty that could have Golden State high-fiving for years to come.